I hope you did get outside and enjoy it. If you like it a little warmer, it'll be getting warmer early this week. If you prefer it cooler, we have a cool down coming. This time of year, we usually have all the kind of things coming up in the next week or two, and that's what we have this week. But really hard not to enjoy the weather this weekend, I think, for most of us. We're still in the lower 70s. Our highs both days at the airport were around 76. Many spots were anywhere between about 75 and 78 or so, so just about perfect. And look at this. Our winds are now from the south up to about 10 or 12 miles per hour. That's going to be bringing in just a little bit more uh, moisture and a slightly higher humidity feel in the next few days. But this evening looking really pleasant. We won't be getting as chilly. Our lows tonight will be mainly in the 50s with those south winds and high pressure eventually shifting eastward. We'll have mostly clear skies tonight. And then tomorrow looks beautiful again, maybe a couple degrees higher than today for the afternoon high, mostly sunny. And we will also have just a tiny bit of a breeze from the south at times, kind of like today, up to about 15 or so miles per hour. Here's your forecast on Monday. Pretty easy to get back into the work or school week when your temperatures are looking like this and you've got sunny skies and overall just a gorgeous feel. Tomorrow evening we're back in the 60s and tomorrow night will not be even as chilly as tonight and you can see the warming trend taking off. In fact, actually both Tuesday and Wednesday we may scrape the 80 degree mark or at least get really close like you see. And then Thursday, boom, we're back to lower 60s with clouds, with a breeze and a much more wintry kind of feel on Thursday. And then for next weekend, we're recovering with our temperatures back into the 70s. We do have that front moving in Wednesday night. It does not look especially rainy though with the front. This is about all I'm seeing with it. Maybe a few showers here and there. I have about a 20, maybe 30% chance for a sprinkle or two or a light shower on Wednesday afternoon or night. The front moves on through quietly. Thursday, we're much cooler. And then actually our rain chance will go back up again Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. So for next weekend, we may have a slightly different feel from the utter perfection that we had this weekend. This could be Friday, potentially in the morning. Don't get too hung up on timing, of course, as we're still several days out. But I think we'll have some scattered rain around on Friday, maybe a couple of showers on Saturday, and then Sunday too, at least a chance for rain. So looking ahead to next weekend, after overall, a very pleasant if warm start to the week, then the cool down Thursday, then Friday. We're still in the 60s with about a 40% rain chance. Saturday, I kept it near 30% and Sunday about 30 to 40%. How much rain are we talking for next weekend? Well, by the end of the weekend, we may have seen anywhere from a couple of tenths of an inch to maybe a couple of inches along our coast. That's the outlook from one model. This is the GFS showing sort of roughly the same idea. Not very much for most of our inland areas, maybe a half inch, three quarters of an inch or less, and then maybe an inch plus along the coast. So of course, we'll keep you updated on these totals and how things are shaping up. But at least it looks like as we get a little system with a warm front just to our south, edging toward us for next weekend and then also a little low pressure area kind of sliding off south of our coastline that should enhance the chance for those showers maybe even a couple of rumbles of thunder here and there for next weekend but there's your seven day forecast the average high right now is 69 so we'll be about 10 degrees higher than that tomorrow tuesday and wednesday and then slightly below that as we head into Thursday and Friday with that cool down. And then for next weekend, comfortable temperatures, low temperatures likely in the 50s to about 60 and our highs in the 70s with that chance for rain. The Pelicans are back in the smoothie.